And now, First One Five Weather with forecaster Stephen Sarabia. Good morning. It is 846 off to a very chilly start this morning. You know, on my way to work, I probably sat inside my car for about five minutes just trying to warm up because of how cold it is. Definitely going to need those jackets. 38 for Port Isabel, 41 for Harlingen and Raymondville, 42 for McAllen and 37 over in Rio Grande City. And in this evening, temperatures are going to get up into the mid 60s, 66 by 3 p.m. Mostly sunny skies. Then by 6 p.m., 58 clear skies, then 48 by 9 p.m. So still going to be very chilly these next couple days, well below the average, which is 73 degrees this time in December. We're going to get to 67 today and 68 for tomorrow. Then temperatures will be back into the 70s by Monday, nowhere near the records, which are at 90 degrees. Here's a look at the wind speeds across the board for the valley. They are nice and calm, though any wind is going to make those cool temperatures feel even colder this morning. So just keep that in mind if you do plan on doing anything outdoors this morning. Here's a look at the coastal forecast. Have two tides, a low tide at 102 p.m. and a high tide at 923 p.m. Small craft use caution. There is a moderate rip current risk. UV rays are moderate as well. Wind speeds come from the northwest at 10 to 15 miles an hour. So I mentioned that temperatures do increase to the 70s on Monday, the start of the work week with partly sunny skies, and that's really the case the entire week. It does warm up on Thursday to about 74, still partly sunny skies. Our next chance to see some rain is on Friday. That's when you're going to need your umbrellas as temperatures are, in the, are at about 73 degrees there, but you're not going to need it for the start of the work week or pretty much most of this week coming up. And one thing to note is the lows these next couple days can be very chilly out there. So once the sun sets, just make sure you still have those jackets handy. And that is your updated first one five forecast.